Bob Baffert's top assistant trainer, Jim Barnes, is about to make a classic understatement. Sunland Oaks has been very good to the Baffert stable with Midnight Lucky, uh, Plum Pretty. I mean, just uh, it's been a good spot for us to come to. I guess so, five wins in the past seven years. The main reason for that success, the top class fillies they bring. And this year's model fits the same mold. Awesome Baby really come around lately. Her last two races have just been phenomenal. She's doing quite well, and uh, I think she'll suit this racetrack quite well also. The competition may be a little stiffer than in the past. Todd Pletcher has brought up-and-comer Lucky for You. She's a bit finicky about her appearance. Pletcher's assistant Jenny DePasquale says the filly refuses to wear her polo wraps, but she didn't mind getting her picture taken. The others have been left behind now as Lucky for You has taken over from Quinn Cat. Lucky for you and Javier Castellano come down to the line in front. Still, Awesome Baby is the one to beat. She's won a graded stakes in each of her past two starts, a complete turnaround from her efforts last fall. You know, it's so hard when they're when they're young in California and everything's short and, you know, she's just a filly that probably, you know, wants to go further. And, um, and she just needed some time to develop and grow. And the addition of Hall of Famer Mike Smith hasn't hurt either. Mike Smith fits her very well, quiet, gets her out of the gate, gets her in the race, and uh, you know, she takes him from there. So if history repeats, that means the winner's circle for the Sunland Park Oaks.